I got to share a joke with you on this mask. This is a serious thing. This mask reminds me of a woman's niqab. You know the niqab? A lot of barakat that niqab has, you know. And I get off a little serious note here. Women having a niqab in Islam, powerful message. How much barakat it has? It hides some women's beauty so they don't attract men. And it hides some women's ugliness so they don't distract men. See barakat? Because people, I'm seeing men wearing this. I don't even know if, what's going on. If they're smiling, if they're quarreling, if they're crying. So I suppose that's what happens with some women, eh? Face cover. You don't, you don't see beauty. You don't see ugliness. You don't see smile. You don't even know if they're angry. And that's what is happening to men nowadays. I don't know if you're happy with the khutbah. If you're smiling. If you're angry. <laughs> Interesting fact. That thought came to mind. Crazy thoughts, eh? But here the most important thing of the niqab and the mask for people nowadays you don't talk much isn't that so you have a muzzle on your mouth less lying less gossip less quarrels at home so husbands please put on a mask home for your wife too so you'll have less talk less quarrel less argument and if she wants to shout loudly it keeps the sound a little down see how much benefit and that's only the mask. What about the niqab? More barakat. So you must benefit from the barakat of things. Some men, we may have to put a mask on them after COVID-19 also, inshallah. To keep their mouths shut, keep their gossip and their line and their garbage shut so we can get full blessings. Anyhow, got to complete the khutbah to do the salah 2.30, inshallah.